To begin setting up an EKM channel in KS Control Cloud, you first need to be in the channels part of the system and then click on new channel at the top of the screen. We're then presented with a dialog where we can select the type of channel that we want to set up. In this case, we'll select EKM. The system will then open the channel setup screen and the first thing we need to do is to give our new channel a name. Once your EKM credentials are entered into the screen, using the channel enable toggle will turn on and off the system's link with your EKM site. The order ref format field allows you to add a prefix or suffix to the EKM order number to allow easy identification of where the orders come from. We recommend that once this has been set it isn't changed to minimise the possibility of the same order being imported twice. Turning on Use Generic Customer will prevent the system from creating new customer records for customers who have ordered from your EKM site for the first time. Instead the system will create a generic EKM customer every month and all orders for that month from new customers will be assigned to the generic customer. When connecting to EKM for the first time it's important that the Don't Import Orders toggle is left on until you've identified any orders on your EKM site that you don't want to import into Case Control Cloud and we'll see how to do that shortly. In order for KS Control Cloud to upload shipping notifications to EKM, the Don't Upload Order status needs to be turned off. Similarly, to upload stop levels to your site, the Don't Upload Stock status needs to be turned off also. It's possible to specify which stock description to use on sales order related paperwork. This can be useful if the descriptions on your website, for example, are in a foreign language. And it's also possible to specify which date to use as the order date, whether it's the date the order was placed on the channel or the date the order was imported into Case Control Cloud. For overseas marketplaces, it's possible to specify a channel currency, but as ours is a UK site, we're going to select pound sterling. This area is where you enter your channel credentials to enable the system to communicate with your EKM site. These options allow the import of customized notes fields on EKM for use in case control cloud as shipping or invoice notes. In global settings under channel order types, it's necessary to set up four attributes on the right hand side of the screen. Firstly, we need to select which site EKM orders are going to be fulfilled from. Any sites need to have been set up in system data beforehand. Next, we need to select a customer classification that will be assigned to all our EKM customers. And again, using the lookup, we need to select a default courier for our EKM orders. Again, the courier services need to have been set up in system data beforehand. And finally, we can set a sales source against our EKM orders to make them easier to report on. Using the new button, we can select further attributes that we might want to set on the right hand side of the screen. For example, bank accounts, key codes, etc. Once the system has connected to EKM for the first time, any additional shipping services you offer will be listed on the left hand side of the screen below the global settings. And specific couriers can be set on the right hand side of the screen using the method we've just seen. Once we've enabled our channel by turning on the channel enable toggle, after a short while any recent orders found on your EKM channel will appear in the imported orders tab. It's important that you review all the orders appearing in this grid and identify any orders that you don't want to import into KS Control Cloud. Then using the grid actions menu, mark them as ignore, don't import. Once you're happy you've done this, you can return to the main tab and turn off Don't Import Orders and then KS Control Cloud will start importing orders from your EKM channel. To find out more about how to control the upload of stop levels to your channel, please see our separate video on the Stop tab. Thanks for watching.